What's up guys, it's your boy Junior here bringing you another great video to the channel. Today we're gonna to be discussing a great product. As most of you know, a few videos ago, I did a video on a sound card by Plow. They sent me the sound card that comes with the XLR mic on there, and it worked great. I tested it out, it worked awesome. I review it, I unbox it for you, and it worked. it's a great little sound card with the mic. Works perfect. When I start podcasting, doing anything like that, you can use that mic and, it, and it's, it's awesome. In my personal opinion, it's awesome. Um, they love the review I did for them and they were happy with it. I guess my video converted for them. So it worked out great. Because of why? Because now they basically are a sponsor of the channel. They want to go ahead and send me products. They sent me a few products to review. And But today I'm going to review a product that I always wanted to pick up but never really did because I personally don't want to use it as much as I want to. I will use it, but not as much as I want to. So for it to take space in my house, it'll be a pain. So you might be thinking, what product am I talking about? If you live in South Florida or any only anywhere there's a sun all year round, this is a definitely must that you want. I mean, you can use this anywhere in the country, in the world, you can use it anywhere. Because you know, every time they have some type of good weather going on, so you can use this during that time. But mostly in South Florida, I know I'll use it a lot. And I live in South Florida, so I know I'll be using it. I've gone to the beaches and people use it there. So you guys are not wondering, what are you talking about? Talking about this right here, it is this little nice little portable PA speaker system right here from Pow. Paul sent it to me and they're like, wow, this is awesome. I love it. It has a lot of features in it from what I read. I haven't opened it, I haven't used it, nothing. And this is gonna be the first time I'm opening it up. But as you see right at the front, you got the whole speaker there. It has RGB color in there and everything. Um, I say this, at the, I see people at the beach because these usually come with um, built-in batteries in it, so it charges. But this one, I do not believe it has a built-in battery. That's why it costs a lot more cheaper than those up there. But regardless, this is good to have at your home. If you have a pool at home and you want to have music in the outdoors and you're doing a barbecue, this is perfect. You plug it up, you have a nice little speaker here and you're all set to go. You can put this at your house to bump music, whatever you want, you can use this for guys. This is awesome in my personal opinion. To go a quick recap of what this does, this has a built-in DVD slash CD player. So that's why uh, if you read on the bottom over here, it says karaoke because you can use this at karaoke because it has inputs, you can put a, a screen to it. So if you have a portable monitor and you wanna watch movies, you can play it off there. Uh, you can play sound off your portable on here, vice versa and all that good stuff. So it has a lot of good features for that. So it has outputs for, for video. So that's why I like it. It has a built-in FM radio, so you know the most most used stations are FM radio channels. So this has a built-in FM channel. Um, it has USB ports, which allows you to plug in hard drives, USB thumb drives, other devices, so you can play your music through here, and it works great. All right, so this is what it looks like. You see, it's a black speaker. On the bottom has a subwoofer and then two tweeters on the bottom and then right on top, I don't know if you can see it, you see like a little slit there, that's the DVD player right there. All right, so this this is the model from Plow. It is PKRK270BT. So this is Bluetooth, so it has that good stuff. So that is the front and back of the box. Same thing, I'm not gonna flip the box, the back one because it has my address and everything. We don't need all that. Okay, and then we flip it to the side. Both sides have the same exact thing. Gives you all the specs you need about this. Just to go over the features it has. It's an all-in-one video and audio karaoke system. Compact, portable, media, entertainment unit. I just described everything does, so that's good. Built-in Bluetooth for wireless audio streaming, which is awesome. And like I mentioned, you know when I mentioned the, the subwoofer on the bottom? That's an eight inch subwoofer. And the two tweeters on the top are three inches each. So that's cool. You have an LED digital display screen on top. And I, like I mentioned, it has a built-in DVD slash CD player on there. Built-in FM radio tuner. It has a USB flash drive input, so you can put your hard drives and all that good stuff. As an aux output cable for three and a half millimeter jack. It has two quarter inch 
microphone input so like i said you could use this for karaoke and that's the reason they named this as a karaoke system as well and you can connect this with any external drive and i'll read it as long as it has a valid format music mp3 fva any of those will work and you can configure the volume bass treble and echo right on top of the control panel and you can use it as a bluetooth device guys up to 30 feet in range so that's awesome i like that really really cool you can read all that specs right there so that's the front side and back and on the top it just has the logo and it says plow and usa and the model number and everything so we're gonna go ahead and open this up now and take a look at what it is um you see it's, the box is not that big i'm right here i'm sitting down and the box is right here it's not that big so i think it's a pretty good size but i'm pretty sure the the speaker itself is gonna be a lot smaller than this because this is the outside box so let's see what's inside. I'm going to open it up real quick right here. All right. Oh, damn. Oh, there you go. Took a minute to pop it up. These tapes are good. All right. So when you first open it up, you see it has a foam cover on top to protect it from, from when they ship it right there. I'm going to pop that open. Once we pop this open, guys, there goes the unit right there. Awesome, it's right there. And like I mentioned, it has a dot top display for the LED screen right there. It has an eject button right here. Got the play, fast forward, rewind. Um, this is the echo controller. This is the mic volume controller here. You got the master volume control here. The two quarter inch mic inputs are right here. You got the power button here. Uh, it has a few other options here. You got the three and a half millimeter line in input right there. And then you got the USB drive right there for your external drives and stuff. All right, so that's pretty cool. So let me get up and take this out so you guys can see. All right, so I'm gonna take it out. So you see the speaker is not that big. You've seen the whole speaker from top to bottom right there, which is pretty awesome. All right, and in, in the rest inside the box, you have this packet right here, which includes all the cables and has a remote control, I guess to control the DVD player, uh, and the manual right here in this little pouch. And inside here, there's nothing else besides the bottom phone protector. Keep this to the side here, because we don't need it right now. All right, so I'm gonna keep it there. And I'm going to take this cover off, this plastic off. All right, so we can take a look at it and see how it looks. All right. So this is looking really nice, as you can see. Look at this great little speaker. So it's a very sleek look. When it's off, at least, it's a very nice, sleek look. Uh, this right here, this white part right here on the, on the subwoofer, this is actually RGB, and I'm pretty sure there's RGB inside here, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I see the two tweeters in here, and this right here, it is the DVD slash CD drive right here. And like I mentioned before, from describing the product, um, they have the master control here, the LED control panel right here, well, the display panel, and I already described all the buttons up here. And in the back, let me turn it around. You got the air vent for the subwoofer down here. Uh, you got the power plug where it plugs in here so you can get power. I don't think this is um, internal battery. I think it's only powered by a DC output. So hopefully it does have a battery. If it doesn't, it is all good still. Um, there's an on and off switch to, to turn off the power supply here. So you, if this is off, it's like a computer, it has two power plugs. So you got the on and off switch here for the power supply and then you got the button here to turn it on and off. Simple as that. And right here, you have three connections here. This is the FM tuner antenna connection right there. You have the RCA cable for your video left and right audio. And then if you don't wanna use that, you can just use the HDMI. So it does have an HDMI, so you can plug into a TV, a monitor, or even a projector if you have one, which I do. So me to use this with a projector will actually be beneficial for me. And I think this will work great. So I'm gonna put this aside and turn it back around. Cause we're gonna go and test it as well. 
All right, but I'm gonna talk about what's in the pouch. First thing, as you can notice, comes with the manual right here. You can read through and see how it all works. All right, um, they got more information here. Um, they give you a one year warranty if you register with them, which is awesome. Just scan the barcode there and then go ahead and start the, for a one year warranty. So that's good, they give you a warranty, which is awesome. Um, here they provide you with a remote. Uh, I'm assuming this is to control the DVD player on there and to control the FM and the tuner to change the channels and to part on and off. Uh, you would have to plug it up and test it out to see. I'm not gonna plug it to a monitor today. Uh, I might do it later down the road, but right now I'm not gonna do that because I'm not gonna use it for that. So it's okay. Um, they also provide you with the power cable right here. It's a regular cable. All right, it's a two prong cable, not a three prong. All right, and then you got the FM antenna right here. Little simple antenna right here, you plug it in right there. And they even provide you with the RCA cables for the video audio to hook it up to any RCA cable adaption. Um, but again, they do not provide HDMI, so if you wanna use HDMI, you have to provide your own HDMI, which is not a big deal, guys. It's really not a big deal. So, let me go and hook this up real quick and see how this runs and how it sounds because we want to test it out. And let me go ahead and get a extension cable. All right, so I did get the extension cable right here. I'm gonna plug this up to the back of the speaker. Let me turn this around here. Plug it up here first. Once I do that, I'm gonna, then I'm gonna plug it in. And then I'm all set. I make sure the power supply is on on the back. And then once we turn, and once it shows power here, I can turn it on from there. So you see right away the RGB. Let me pull it back a little bit so you can see more of it. See the whole front end lights up. So it's just this bottom piece right here behind the mesh and the circle. Up here, they have a button called LED mode. So you can change the mode on here. I believe it has about four or five modes. So that's the main one. That's, that's the second one. That's the third one. Fourth one. Fifth one. And that's off. So they have five modes plus off. And then you can go back to the normal one there. And over here, you can see right away, I don't know, you're gonna be able, yeah, you can see it right there. That is the place, so if you change the mode, you can change the mode right there and go to whatever you want, which is pretty cool. All right, like I already talked about all the modes that they have on here. So right now, I'm gonna put it on Bluetooth and then I'm gonna use my phone to do it. So I'm gonna change it to Bluetooth. All right, so I have it on Bluetooth now. Do I have, I have the volume pretty high, so I don't wanna put it that high, let me put it down. All right, so this is gonna go, when you're looking for your Bluetooth on your phone, it's gonna look it up with the model number. That's how you can tell the Bluetooth it is. So I'm gonna go ahead and find the Bluetooth, open up my, my device, go to my connections. All right, so opened up my Bluetooth connections here. These are all my connections that I have connected right now. So right now it's on, it's looking for my Bluetooth. So I gotta go down to my available, available ones. And right down here, I'm sure right there is gonna be the model number of the, of the, of the device. So I just click on that, let it pair. It's gonna pair right there, hit pair. And it should beep here. Okay, so it's connected, but it didn't, the, oh, cause I have the volume down. So it would have made a sound if it connects. But whatever, right, let me put the volume up a little bit so you guys can see it. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and play my video. I would test this with music, but you guys know how YouTube is with the copyright. So I'm gonna go ahead and just play one of my YouTube videos. Uh, so let me go to YouTube real quick. Find one of my videos.
All right, so I'm on my page right now. As you see, these are all my videos here. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm actually gonna do open up the video that did the review on the sound card. Let me let me find there. Okay, let me see. I do a lot of gaming. Okay, all right. So this is the video I did on their sound card. I'm gonna open that one up. And you see the sounds coming out of this speaker right here. And as it's playing music, it changes the sound. I mean, the LD, the RGB changes around when you're playing. All right. Hey guys, are you guys looking for a sound See? card for your PC? This is awesome. And that's that's on low volume. Let me turn it up. It's pretty loud, guys. It's pretty loud. I have to turn it out because I don't want to wake up my neighbors or anything. <laughs> but there you guys go. This is awesome. Let me pause it because we don't need to play this anymore. But as you see, as soon as I stop, the RGB stop changing color. So it goes by the RGB, which is pretty awesome in my personal opinion. And really, I think this is an awesome device. So now, let me see if this is battery powered. Because like I said, I don't think it's battery powered because it doesn't. it's not heavy enough to be battery powered. Um, so right now what I'm gonna do, you're gonna see the light, I'm just gonna unplug it from here. I'm just gonna unplug it and see if it stays on, that means that it has a built-in battery and we could take it to the beach and not worry about it. All right, so. And as you see, as soon as I take off the plug, it stops lighting up, stops working, everything turned off. So this is not battery powered. That's the only downside about it guys, but other than that, this is an awesome device. If you have a home, Especially if you have a backyard, a nice backyard, you do barbecues or you have a pool and you want to listen to music outside. This is a great, great device to have at home. And if you want to have a movie night outside in your home, on your, on your pool, on your backyard, you can bring this out and have a projector. If you have a projector, which I do, I have a mini projector as well. You could combine both of them together and boom, you have a whole outdoor entertainment system, which is awesome. Again, I would leave a link to this product down below if you do want to get it, guys. It's an awesome product in my opinion. It's not bad of a price. You can check it out and, and, and see if that works for you. All right, so that's it for today. I do appreciate you coming by and watching the channel and enjoy it. So if you did enjoy the channel, everything I had to do today, guys, go ahead and give me a big old thumbs up. Show me all the love and support that you guys love to show the channel. Also, don't forget to hit that share button because sharing is caring and we want to make sure that everybody's aware of everything we do on this channel so they don't miss out just like you're not missing out. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, put them in the comment box down below and I'll get to you as soon as I can, when I can, when I can. And if you still haven't done so to the end of this video, guys, hit the subscribe button and enable bell notifications so you get notified every time we drop great videos like this one or whenever we go live. Because trust me, guys, you never, ever, ever want to miss that. And that's it for today, guys. Until next time, I'm out of here. Peace.